This is without doubt the best menu I've done so far working for the Lost Estate. My name's Ash Clark and I'm the executive chef for the Great Murder Mystery. For the starter, one of Sherlock's favourite things to do is have breakfast for dinner and his favourite breakfast dish is ham and eggs. We're going to make our own duck ham, we're going to do confit eggs, there's going to be some pickled cherries on there, there's going to be some brioche cooked in a way to represent the toast element of a, of a breakfast, but obviously it's going to be super refined. To serve 250 people to the standards that we, we've set and we expect of ourselves is a huge challenge. It's, it's military operation. Everything has an exact process, time and temperature attached to it. And every person in the kitchen knows their role. And it's also a huge accomplishment when we finish a service, we're wiping down and we know we've done the best we can do. The main course is this amazing free range Yorkshire chicken breast. And with that, we're gonna stuff that with a chicken and, and black truffle mousse. We've got parmana, which is this like layers of potatoes and duck fat and thyme which is pressed and then deep fried to become super crunchy. A pea tart, lovely light little pea tart and then this beautiful chicken jus to bring it all together. So with the main, the idea is that you're attending a press conference at Sherlock's home. So Sherlock asks Mrs Hudson to get in touch with his favourite restaurant which is Simpson on the Strand and to get, get the chicken dish and see if they could deliver the chicken dish to Baker Street. Not that I think takeaways were a big thing but I, think I can't imagine Deliveroo were doing much back in Victorian England. Everybody within the company, from the founders down to myself, we're not saying yes as easily to things. So the challenges have been the amount of presentations and tastings and ingredients and going back to the drawing board over and over again. It is challenging. It pushes you and it pushes everybody else around us. We just keep having to step it up a notch or two. I've still got the main players from, from 2021 because um, they were great, great guys and girls. So they've, they've grown with, with us and myself as, and the business over the past few years. So they're still here. And then we've just beefed out the team with a lot more talent. The main core of my team, the, you know, it's not just me, obviously. You know, I've got my senior sous chef, stroke head chef, Bart, who's not just been with me since I started working for the Lost Estate. He's also been with me in sort of three other restaurants I've run in London. He's been my right hand man, you know, he's, he's one of the best cooks I've, I've ever worked with. Conference is well overrun by this point. Um, there's no way that the guests could leave without having something sweet. Um, so Mrs Hudson sent out to pick up some desserts and she's come back with this whipped um, cream cheese mousse and some fresh strawberries dressed in, a beautiful strawberry um, syrup and uh, some crunchy oat cakes and the most amazing lavender and champagne sorbet. It's difficult to say we're like X or Y, we're just not, it's just different. I, I just don't think you'll find a dining, entertainment experience, anything like this, in the UK let alone just London. 